Not a deal, y'all. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Ready to go? Yeah, I'll go to Uncle House. I'm gonna go to Uncle House. Yes. Tom Tom. Mm -hmm. Are you ready to go? Yes. Yeah, Miss Mommy. Yeah. Oh wait, no. Tony says he has one of his tapping shoes. Let me see you tap, Tom Tom. Woo! Go boy. Maybe that will be his his talent. Maybe I should buy you some tapping shoes. Can I get her my tablet at Uncle House? You can get your tablet at Uncle House after school. You still have to do school this morning. Uh, you. Ah. No, I'm you got to do all of it. Huh? Wig. Look at my wig. <laughs> How you know this wig? That's my hair. That's my hair. Stop. You messing it up. <laughs> How dare you? You've been around mommy too much. Okay, we gotta get ready to go. Okay, we're headed to Vegas. Look at that. Ooh, very shaky. <laughs> we're headed to Vegas. Four days. Yes. Yeah. I got something here though. Wipe down the plane. You should wipe down the seat. We got spray. We got any spray? Even keeping my distance from Devon, because I don't know what he gonna come in contact with at the airport. Not playing about this. But you may get a little too comfortable and not use your hand sanitizer after touching something. Do you have hand sanitizer on you? I got three. I got wipes. What kind of wipes? I don't know if I'm be able to be on the plane for three hours. <laughs> Three hours with a mask, Lord have mercy. At least not this mask. I got a, I got like two other ones I may need to try. <sighs> this one is a little hard to breathe or, or else I'm just out of shape. Yeah, I can't lie. I am so nervous. <laughs> I'm kind of shaking. I'm, I'm just, I'm nervous because, oh, he's right there. <laughs> okay. <laughs> the line can't get the um the tags to print out, but I'm just I'm nervous because you know Corona. <laughs> so so far I haven't touched anything. Y'all know I just touched my face. Y'all saw me just touch my face, but and I haven't touched anything. Just. Just want to come back home safe, no corona. Just have a good time. So, I just want to make sure that I, you guys know there's a fee for me to be yeah. on oh. oh, that. Right. Oh, okay. Okay. Uh, we get cut. <laughs> they said we have nothing to be worried about. We don't pray. We don't root these demons. We don't want to do. <laughs> I don't know what they told us. We don't pray. We pray around these parts. Sorry. Oh, no. Oh, yeah. Stop trying to be with slips and find you a real one. That's, that's why it's, it's nice to get what I want. You know what that is, right? Stop it! <laughs> Damn right. 
<laughs> y'all caught the end of the conversation. <laughs> Vegas, y'all, so much is closed. The Vegas airport. Look at all of this is closed. Even like the little slot machines, they're closed. So hopefully, you know, we still have a lot of stuff planned that's like outside of Vegas. So we're still gonna have fun. But it's just gonna be weird to not see we that Vegas atmosphere. We don't go gamble. We don't go gamble party anyway. No, we don't. It's not what we normally do when we come to Vegas. But it's just still like weird not to have the Vegas atmosphere around. You know the liveliness and all the people. Y'all, that plane ride was kind of brutal. It was hard to breathe. I was cold. I had to pee. I've never peed on a plane before, ever in my whole entire life. I've never peed. And of course, during the pandemic, I had to pee. I was so scared. <laughs> and so I went to an airplane bathroom for the first time in life. And when I tell you how I got in and out of there was almost magic, I wasn't touching nothing. So Vegas are already trying to mess with me now. My bag ain't here. They said it's not gonna be here until 1.30. I have never had my luggage to not arrive. It's actually like one of my biggest fears. <laughs> so yeah, my makeup bag is in there too. So uh-uh. Where's my luggage? Focus on winning, losers focus on winners. <laughs> That's a nice takeaway. Is that a buffet? How empty it is. Very empty. Oh, the buffet not open? No, it's not open. Oh, well, damn. Well, I will be. She can open the buffet. Vegas 2020. The buffet is not open. It's one of those poplars. Watermelon? Yeah, fresca. You want one of those? I don't want an alcohol drink though. Okay, well, I, we'll just do one. Um, one more fresca. And yeah. what do you want? Um, water for now. Water? I'll be yeah. water for the young one. Thank you. Mm -hmm. I want something refreshing, but not with alcohol. Mm -hmm. Like a cucumber. Like a what? This thing coming out here acting like a little pump. I ain't trying to just. Go all out. I still gotta get my suitcase. I got stuff to do when I get in the hotel. Show you, show you something. Time to get me lit and loaded already. So the menu is on this little thing. And we decided to sit outside. It's a nice little view and it's not too hot. Pretty cool. You already know what you're getting? No, oh, okay. This little uh Oh, impossible sliders. Sound good. <laughs> yeah, this is a mock cocktail and it is so good. It is like really good. You won't try it, taste it. It's really good. It's like a hint of soda, sugar water. 
tea. There's like a taste of tea. It's so good. Um, y'all deliver the bags. Y'all the one. I know, right? Can they not deliver the bag? I was they gonna say, say. Can, but they said they're not gonna get here until ten o'clock. I'm not like what? It's twelve. Yeah, they won't get it until until ten o'clock tonight. You can come back and get them. Alexa, like last time. That's probably the thing I was looking forward to the most. <laughs> oh boy, why you gotta do the dramatic, Antonio? <laughs> Doing stuff you see. Me. Okay, so we are at Walmart. And it's like the same little mirror from last time, so y'all like my outfit. This is my outfit of the day. I will put the link in the description box below. I got it from um, Clue Couture. I really like her shop. I've got a couple of stuff from her. So, got this. Duran said I got the camel toe. <laughs> but yeah, I'll put the link to this. I don't know if you still have this, but because um, it's like summer, about to be over. But it was a cute outfit that I got at the beginning of summer and couldn't resist finally getting the chance to wear it and i'm happy with it so mm. oh, we are rushing at late for dinner late late but as soon as i sit down i gotta get to the bathroom <laughs> i don't know if y'all can see my dress this is my dress hopefully i can get a better glimpse for y'all a little later we're brushing right now. <laughs> All right, so dinner. Chicken skewers and maybe brought us out a black bread pizza, which I tow up. We're in a little closet room. Let's see. So Uh, 
bike trip up to like some Red Rock Mountain or something, so that'll, that'll be awesome. And then we'll also have a nice private dinner Saturday night, so we'll talk further. But uh, if everyone can give themselves a hand, thanks for the hard work. And, and all the support, and you know, I'll hand these out. Please, ladies, do not give this to your man. Go buy yourself something. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Wow. Behind every great man is a great woman. So we thank you for all your support. Please accept this gift as a token of our appreciation. Wow. Oh my god. So is this why overhead is going or what? I feel like this would be good to bring on Saturday. <laughs> Yeah, yeah. <laughs> so here is my outfit. Let me show y'all. I got a full link there, but we're about to go to Seven Magic Mountains. Let me show y'all. So I got this little number also from Amazon, but I got some heels that I'm gonna put on with it when we get there. But isn't it cute? And it wasn't. It wasn't too bad of a price, so I'll put that link in the description box below too. Huh? Well, yeah, I'm saying it would be cute to get their name right there, but I don't know like how professional that would be, you know, or that you would want it to look. Be professional, like the person who did it. No, like being out. Oh, with my job. Yeah. I'm a contractor. People already don't take it serious. <laughs> <laughs> well, I mean, it would, it would be fine to get their name tattooed right there. Or almost a voice tattoo. Right, their name tattooed. the natural style anyway so it may fluff up and that'll be cute for tonight so i'm just gonna take a full shower because when that dust blew y'all and it messed up my camera it messed up my new camera so i'm on the old camera thank god i brought it otherwise i would not have been able to vlog but um so i'm on the old old faithful and um the other one, I'm gonna have to get it checked out. Is when all of the sand and everything blew it, it blew inside of the camera, and so now it won't even come on. But I'm gonna take all this off, all of it off, and um, yeah, I'm gonna get a complete shower, just start over, start this whole 
holes when I came down here clean. That's the level I'm trying to get to, get Corona off me. And then people just keep sending me stuff about the Corona cases down here increases, increasing and how they're high and I know that. Um, so I had the first person that sent it to me, I'm like, okay. And now my parents just sent me a little video of them recording the news about the cases. The first article was like 500 people tested positive in this hotel, the employees. So, my nerves are already bad, but all I can do is just pray to God. I just, I gotta pray and wash my hands and don't touch my face. I've already washed my hands. That's why I'm about to take a full-on shower. Just take a full-on shower right now, including wash my hair. And, um, just hope and pray that Corona don't come nowhere near us. You know, the housekeeper passed my test. I left a $20 bill sticking out my wallet and she moved the wallet but didn't move the $20 bill. She passed my test. Dora said she passed his test. I said, okay, what was your test? <laughs> he told me I left my drawers under the bed and she touched them. <laughs> I'm gonna take a shower. I'm gonna clean up all over. Hey y'all, I just washed this wig and look at this. This hair is so pretty. I just blow dried it because that's the effect that it's supposed to have. But I just washed it and conditioned it with the shampoo from the hotel. And y'all, this hair, I cannot believe this came from an Amazon, uh, um, Amazon store. Like, I really can't. I wish I could think of the name, but I'll put it below. But look how pretty. And, and like, no shedding. Like, little to no shedding while I was... Dang, this is some good hair for an Amazon store. I'm excited. I'm going to straighten it out just a little. Or probably not. I probably just wear it puffy like this. This is some good hair. Look at that flow. Ooh. Okay, guys. Here's my other look for the evening. So, yeah, see, I washed the hair, but I'm going to keep it, like, puffy like this. Is this the look I was going for? with this outfit just want to keep it very really natural looking chic but this outfit i got from swank posh i forget they're black owned actually um so check them out i will put their information in the description box too but it's a little two-piece outfit and just something comfortable we're about to just go walk i think and find drinks Let's go check it out, huh? Head of a blackjack table. Cool beans. It's the original pan. Customers needed at deodorant. Customers needed at deodorant. Share number three, please. Oh, that is in the chat. Yeah. Customer service needed at deodorant. Customer service needed at deodorant.
I'm so excited. I've always wanted to try Krabby Patties. Always. Figured you guys could get unready with me. Just got through washing off my makeup. And couldn't really do it in the shower. So, uh, this is the little brush I bought from Marshall's during their little annual sale. It was $9. Ugh, and it just really, really helps me. I feel like I'm getting clean. That's a deep clean. Mm. I just feel like after being out and like going on the strip, you have to like clean your whole entire body before you get into bed. And the crazy thing is, I remember last year when we left, the next day I got sick. I had like a really bad respiratory infection, do y'all remember? And I had to cancel my first surgery appointment. I still got a lot of makeup on. Brush and picked up. But um, that's when I had to cancel my first surgery appointment because I had just got back from Vegas and I was extremely ill. Um, I had like a respiratory infection. But um, so I'm just making sure, and I was, I thought I was pretty careful, but of course I wasn't like coronavirus careful last year. So who knows how I got sick last year. And this is, um, this is my African black, so I take it everywhere. It is, you know, I showed y'all it's like the real raw authentic. African black soap that comes with the clay and even if I'm going out of town I would pinch off like a little nugget to take with me out of town because it is the only thing I want to wash my face with so <sighs> only thing about it I'm back in the moisturizer I did not bring moisturizer with me We are in pretty early. We're in pretty early because tomorrow, tomorrow is um, the girls' outing, and then um, the boys, the guys, will have their car thing. I think they're going out to to race cars, so that should be fun. And then um, the wives and girlfriends, we are going to go um, on like a scooter trail is I don't know it sounds fun but it's just gonna be hot <laughs> so um, I got me some SPF 30 I'll show y'all that but other than that I'm gonna get in bed it's my little outfit my little bedtime outfit I'll show you also got my hands on so a little bedtime outfit <sighs> because it is true to me. So, yeah, another little outfit that I got from Amazon Sleepwear. Y'all know I love pajamas. So, I need to take this necklace off before I hop in the bed. But other than that, that's it. Day two. Day two done.